The other big story today, a major setback for the hijab petitioners of coastal Karnataka who had dominated headlines in February. After weeks of upheaval, the Karnataka High Court today upheld the ban on Muslim girls wearing hijab on campus in contravention of uniform requirements. Dismissing, dismissing the petition, the court said hijab is not an essential religious practice in Islamic law. Soon after the verdict, the Karnataka chief minister urged all students to maintain peace and get back to their studies. Here's a report. For months, protests rocked not just Karnataka, but different parts of India. For months, there was raging polarization in educational campuses, allegedly by vested interests. All that may possibly end now. The Karnataka High Court has put out its final word in this matter. After hearing the case for over 11 days, the three-judge bench ruled that the hijab ban in educational institutions is valid in law. The High Court dismissed all petitions, putting out a detailed order exploring all religious aspects that were raised in the course of the hearing. The court primarily ruled on three issues. One, that wearing hijab is not an essential Islamic practice. Two, that students can't object to uniform. And three, that the government can issue an order with regards to uniformity in educational campuses. The court has relied upon the principles evolved by the Supreme Court in Shabarimala, four or five principles, okay. and has upheld that uh, there was no evidence produced by the petitioners to hold that it formed part of ERP. Soon after the verdict, the Karnataka government hailed the order with Chief Minister Bomai appealing for peace with this message. I request everybody in the society in the uh, parents, teachers, students, and those who are concerned about education to um, whatever the High Court has said, we have to uh, see that it is implemented and peace and order is maintained. The Karnataka High Court in its order also slammed the violence and riot-like situation that broke out weeks ago in parts of Karnataka over the controversy. The court even alleged that an unseen hand was involved in the violence. The petitioners, students in Udupi, who spearheaded the right to wear hijab stir, have made it clear that they will not end their fight now. They will be approaching the Supreme Court for relief, they say. We, have, we will take our time and we will let, let everyone know about this. But we will be going on all the legal ways and uh, we will take this procedure okay, forward. The, the Karnataka High Court's order now puts an end to the hijab controversy that's taken centre stage in the last few months across the state of Karnataka. Over to the top court now to see whether it will agree with the Karnataka High Court stand or will provide some sort of relief to the petitioners. Along with Pramod and Nagarjun, this is Nolan Pinto for India Today.